Oh my god, it's so foggy outside. Hey guys, welcome back to a new vlog. Um, I had to wake up at 6 o'clock in the morning today just so that we can go to the dentist because the, the appointment is at 8 o'clock uh, in the morning and I have to be awake and have an energy drink in me and brush my teeth and make sure I pee everything out because I don't need to, because I don't want any fluids in me uh, when I'm in a chair. So it's a little nerve wracking because I don't want to end up finding out that they're going to keep the braces on until like July or something. So yeah, I'm not excited at all. Oh god, it's frosty. Ugh. Oh my god, it's so foggy outside. Yes, it is. And it's we'll cold. It. Oh, I smell trash now. Well, we're going to the dentist. Yay. <laughs> and it's like extremely foggy. I think this is the sec- this is- Wait, this is the first time it's not cloudy when I'm going to the dentist, but it's also extremely foggy. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Actually, last time I remember we were blinded leaving this one. Was the summer so bright? In the morning? Yeah. Oh. Why do they have it so early? Don't uh, don't they get booked for 12 and 1 p.m. and 2 p.m.? I don't know. Oh my god, you can't see, like, you can barely see anything in front of you. That's creepy. Yeah. How many times is it like this when you're going to work? Uh, a lot, actually. Okay, now this is just creepy. Just, all, all it is is fog. <sighs> We better find out when they're taking my braces off. I want to eat chips again and gummy worms. I know. Well, I'm not supposed to wear the wires anymore. Oh, yeah? But they said next time I'm supposed to wear them again. What? So in eight weeks, the next appointment, I'll have to wear them again. What are they doing? I don't know. I asked them when they're supposed to get off. They were signaling, signaling that there wasn't many le uh, appointments left, but they said they didn't know when to take them off. Oh, you know what? What do you think about that? I don't know. And my next appointment is on Friday the 13th in May. Yeah. So first it was October, then it was January, then it was April, and I'm not getting them off in May, so it's gonna be what, July? Oh, and then August, and then September, and then October, so that's a whole extra year for what? Are they not moving correctly? Well, oh, guys, I'm back home. My dad had to. My dad had to go to work. Um, I'm not sure I'm too happy right now because, you know, I was supposed to get them off in October. Then when we moved here, they said, "Oh, you'll get them off in January," and then they said April, and now. Well, I was supposed to go back there in May, so probably June. Um, but they didn't make it sound like the next appointment is the last. So that would mean August. So basically, I'm really confused right now because, like, why did I have to have braces on for an entire extra year? Like, are, are they not moving correctly? Are they not doing it correctly? Like, I just don't understand. And it doesn't... Now, guys, I know some of you are probably going to say, oh... They just can't predict it. They just don't know. But when we were in Pennsylvania, they never... They always said October. Every single time I came there, they said, Oh, you're getting closer. October or November. They didn't ever push it back. They always said October. Every single time I came there. And then we move here. They just don't seem to know when to take them off. Like, January, and then April, and then June, and then August, and then October, and then December, and then February, and I just want them off so that I can eat gummy worms and Doritos and not have to worry about something crunchy and, you know, even when we go to restaurants, I, I have to be careful with the rolls. If they're too crunchy, I, have, I can't eat them, and it's, it's getting annoying. Guys, I just went to the bathroom and noticed that they put, like, these, uh, big blue things on my teeth. Huh. Um, I'm guessing that's so that I don't accidentally bite into the brackets and stuff, but that's a little insane. All I know is I'm finding all this to be a little confusing. Um, today they said I didn't have to wear these rubber bands on them anymore, but then somehow next time I'm gonna start, I'm gonna have to start wearing them again. But I don't have to wear them now. 
<sighs> but next time in May is supposed to be a month after when I was supposed to get the braces off. So what the heck is going on? Well guys, got myself a big old bowl of uh, Cocoa Pebbles. Luckily my teeth aren't too sore right now and I don't really need to bite and crunch and chew cereal because it's like, you know, because it's cereal. This is some quality content. Dad just said there's a weird cloud. What's the weird cloud? Well, was, look at the house there. See how it's bright on this side? And then look up above it. Uh, I don't know. Ew. Why would it be fine? It doesn't get dark earlier. It's dark later. Whoa, that's creepy. Oh, that's right. Spring forward. That's right. This would be. Wait, that's forward. creepy. It's 740. It is creepy looking, isn't it? Like, it looks like it's been a storm. Uh, is it? Huh? Well, is it gonna storm? Maybe. That's creepy looking. How is it even like that? <laughs> this is creepy. The camera probably can't really do justice of what it really looks like. Yeah. All right, I gotta pee. Good for you. Oh, tomorrow we gotta stop at Family Dollar or Kroger. Why? We gotta stop there. For what? Tomorrow's Friday. I know. Because Saturday there's a Saturday huge snowstorm. Snowstorm. So there's no, sh we can't do shopping on Saturday. And it'll uh, that part is Yeah. And Sunday won't be, was, Sunday won't be warm enough to melt all of it. Yeah, so we're, we're doing, uh, a drive around recording the gas prices. What, tomorrow? Yeah. Well, when you get home from work? Yeah. yeah. So, I figure while we're out, I'll stop and get my ID. Yeah. <sighs> That's so creepy. Alright guys, so it's currently the next day, and, um... I found something out that I didn't realize until now. So, so, I was wondering, why are my cheeks feeling weird when I was eating dinner last night? Last night I had a bowl of uh, soup. I didn't really film it, because uh, why would I need to film every single time I eat? <laughs> but uh, I felt like I felt like there was something wrong because there was like something was different. Like I felt like a scraping on the sides of my cheeks, and I go to you know look at the mirror, and I just I realized something that I didn't. It's something that just didn't register in my brain. Yesterday, when I was at the dentist, they told me they were adding four braces to my teeth. I, it, it didn't, now they did tell me this. this. This is like the only detail they ever told me. But, um, it just didn't register in my brain that they actually were until now. And so, I want to, I, I just want to get my point of view across that, it's been two and a half years of having braces. I was not supposed to have them on this long. I was supposed to only have them on for two years. And it's already two years and five months now. And it looked like I was getting pretty close to getting them off before we moved. At this time, they, uh, right here in the back, they put braces on my back chewing teeth. I don't understand, but... I know when I was in PA, they said I did not need braces on those teeth. So now I'm actually really more confused. And I'm not a dentist, so I, I just, you know, I just don't know. But I'm supposed to be getting my braces off. Why are they adding braces? Why are they adding more braces? Like, it's, it's getting a little infuriating because I don't want to be 21 years old and still having braces. Like, I'm not supposed to have them on this long. Like, how long am I supposed to have them on? Five years? My back teeth don't need to be moved. They, they have been straight this entire time. I don't understand that part. The only thing I will say is, from what I see when I look in the mirror, my like canine teeth right here, they look like they need to move down a little bit. But other than that, it looks like my teeth are, you know, fine. Um, but please guys, let me know in the comments if you think this is a little strange, because I don't understand why are they keep why do they keep moving the goalpost? When we moved here and I and we had our first appointment with them, they didn't even change the braces. They just had to look at my teeth and see what was going on because they were new at it. And uh, they told us they told us January, and I was like, okay, that's not too bad. And then the next appointment, with, before they even did my braces, I asked like, when am I supposed to get them off? And then they and then they said April. My question is. 
What made them think January was actually a month that they could take them off? And then what actually changed? And that was without them even doing anything. The first appointment, they didn't do anything to my braces. So what got them to the conclusion that it's going to be four extra months than expected? Like, what changed? And then the next appointment, they say, okay, uh, April. A probably April. And then this time, I don't think I even gave you guys this detail yet, but yesterday, I asked the assistant that was actually doing the work, I was like, hey, do you have any idea when I'm getting my braces off, how many appointments are left? She said, I don't know. I don't know. And that's probably an accurate thing an assistant would know is nothing. Um, except for actually, you know, doing the dentist stuff. So I was like, okay, I asked. I don't know what else to do now. And then I asked the, the lady at the front desk, like, hey, do you, can you get any details? Can Do you have any idea? Is there any way you can find out when I'm supposed to get my braces off? And she said, oh, you're supposed to ask them in the back when they're doing your teeth. But that's what I did, and they said they didn't know. So, shouldn't they be giving us details? Shouldn't they be telling me what's going on? Why is it taking so long? Because in Pennsylvania, they were about to take them off in November, okay? And it's obvious the between the two dentist uh, companies, I guess, they do things differently. It's very obvious there. But it's just like... Would I have had my braces off by now if I was in living, if we were living in PA? And if that's true, it's kind of annoying because it's like, I want them off. You know, I'm old now. I'm 20 years old. I shouldn't have to wait an extra year to get my braces off for no reason. Like, they look fine to me now. There is so many difficult things when it comes to having braces on. Especially the part where we, I always have to go back to the dentist every eight weeks and then they do something and then my teeth are sore for an entire month and I can't eat regular food. Like, yesterday, like today is when my teeth are really sore. Usually the first day isn't so bad and then my teeth get sore the next day and then slowly it gets back, it gets back to normal. But that's one problem. The other thing with braces is that I have I can't eat Doritos and Pringles and Fruit Loops and crunchy things and gummy worms and Welch's fruit snacks and popcorn and all a bunch of other things that I can't eat. And so my only problem is I just want to know what's going on and it's getting really annoying because now it looks like I'm not getting them off until next year or something. Like I'm so it's getting it's really frustrating me. And it would help if I at least knew why I'm not getting them off. Because now, I'm going back in May, and if they are telling me that I have to wear my rubber bands again uh, in eight weeks, that means they're going to have another appointment after that, which means eight weeks after May would be like July. That would be the second appointment again, and then, and if that was the last appointment, that would mean I would get them off in September. One month before an entire extra year. What is causing the extra year? That's just frustrating me. I know I'm ranting about this a lot, but it's just frustrating because I was excited to have them off for two and a half years, and now I'm expected to not get them off until like, th at the end of this year. Like, why? Why? Why is this happening? What changed? Are my teeth not moving correctly? I just want to know. And it doesn't seem like they know, they know either. And then the other thing is, they tried to do surgery on my dad's eye, and they didn't do that successfully either, so it's like, do the people around here even know what they're doing? But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, video. In the next video, we're going to go around and show the gas prices around here, and just document what's really going on about that, because that's a current event, and that deserves a whole other video uh, by itself. Make sure to leave a like if you liked the video, subscribe if you're brand new to the channel, and I'll try to, and I'm going to keep trying on uploading every single day. See you guys later. Bye.